everyone. I've got an especially interesting project to review today called Datum, which has the novel vision of placing control of a person's digital data firmly into their own hands, free to do with as they see fit and free from misuse by large companies. This is a mammoth task, of course, so we'll need to be backed by strong fundamentals if the project has a chance of achieving its goals, which we are about to analyze. I will provide insight into the Dayton project in order to answer these two questions, who and what, namely who are Dayton and what are they trying to accomplish? Essentially a detailed overall project analysis. Before I begin, a quick disclaimer, please always do your own research. Also remember that this is my opinion and not financial advice. My content is for educational and entertainment purposes only. Datum's motivation. Datum foresees a future in which the data created by the online activity of a user securely and assuredly their own. If data can be verifiable accessible only to the user from whom it originated, then not only will this result in an environment in which individuals' rights to privacy are firmly respected, but this data is also able to make into a valuable, tradable commodity. Datum is clearly driven not by greed and financial lust, but a real passion to enhance the lives of everyday internet users on multiple levels, whilst promoting a more generally beneficial perspective. The type of motivation and drive shown by Datum is refreshing to see in this space. Team details. The diverse Datum team, headed by their notably experienced CEO, Roger Haini, has a massive amount of experience, amounting to in excess of 100 years combined in relevant fields, building large scale data processing and management systems. The team are a global force with bases in Switzerland, Singapore and Hong Kong. Of course, Datum have already completed their token sale several months ago and are well on the way to following through on their vision of creating an ultimately fair and secure data transaction network. The data team thus far have proven their dedication with their persistent progress and commitment to working towards the best of the project blockchain-based solution. Datum are providing the tools for users to store their personal data securely within Datum's network and powered by blockchain users can be verifiably secure that this data is not accessed let alone abused by any parties which have not already been granted access. This optional granting of access can either be voluntary if the user so wishes or alternatively a price and usage stipulations can be set per individual piece of data and thus users can choose to profit from their valuable personal data in this way if they so wish. Storage Through Datum's innovative platform which users can easily access through the Datum Android or web app, personal data can be compartmentalized and stored securely as the platform is based on blockchain, users can be verifiably sure that their stored data is not being misused. Monetization. Each year, through your personal data generated online, you create in excess of $2,000 worth of value. This value is never seen or even heard of by the user who passively gives consent for this to take place by using online services they believe to be free. Corporate data is also hugely valuable and the same concept applies to such organizations. Also, it's not just individuals who are harvesting for their data for nothing in return. Datum is facilitating a way for users to easily and effectively monetize the data which is already securely stored in their network. Setting their own prices and terms, users will be compensated in DAT tokens for the data they wish to make available for the purchase. Notable features. Better quality data. 
The Dayton project is generally notable for its beneficial mission and innovative approach. However, there are a couple of features which make Dayton particularly interesting. Other than the fact that this new approach will do much to empower the user and take control from big companies, Dayton's very approach will undoubtedly provide a higher quality data pool. The data collected, covertly by companies each year, is massive in amount, but questionable in terms of quality. The information which people supply online, of course not necessarily expecting this data to be harvested and sold for other users, may not accurately reflect that user. However, a user incentivized to provide data will inevitably be inclined to provide quality, accurate data when they wish to make it available to outside entities. So to conclude, we have the who and what of the Dayton project. The who, a team of dedicated experts led by a visionary in the field pursuing their vision of an ultimately secure and fair data transaction network. The what is an innovative blockchain powered decentralized data network, which not only offers users, both personal and corporate, verifiably secure data storage, but also facilitates easy and customizable monetization of this data. Dayton's vision is one which will not only enhance the blockchain space, but the online space overall. The team are well on their way to making their vision a reality, having already released a fully functioning app and have so far displayed excellent motivation by consistently working to make progress. In my next video on Datum, we will be exploring the why of the project, why is Datum necessary, and why blockchain. That is all for today guys, I'll leave the link to the Datum website so you can check it out for yourselves. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe if you want to see more reviews. I've got a lot more insightful reviews on the way and I'll see you again very soon.